The Mayo contingent is commanded by Deputy Superintendent of Immigration, Mustafa Yaya. The supernumeraries are ASI Emmanuel Ohini Ejei Jechi and ASI Asamoa Opuku Menta. The contingent sergeant major is Inspector Samuel Oping Ofe. The female contingent is commanded by DSI Comfort Kofi. And the supernumeraries are DSI Matilda Eureka Kang and ASI Doreen Jechi. The contingent sergeant major is Inspector Benibe Afenyo Deborah. The number 19 and number 20 contingent are from the National Ambulance Service. The male contingent is commanded by Advanced EMT Reginald Frimpong with Advanced EMT Ejiri Felix as a supernumerary. The contingent sergeant major is Advanced EMT Bani David Selassie. The female contingent is commanded by Senior EMT AJ Techiwa Beatrice with Senior EMT Watson Ajua Jomo and Advanced EMT Fatih Lali as the supernumeraries. The contingent sergeant major is Advanced EMT Luko Millicent. Your Excellencies, distinguished invited guests, ladies and gentlemen, we will now witness the equipment display by the various security services. Leading the equipment display are the quad bikes from the 64 Infantry Regiment of the Army Special Operations Brigade. Quad bike is an all-terrain vehicle with low pressure ties with handlebars for steering. They are used for reconnaissance and also to assess difficult terrain. On each quad bike this afternoon is a sniper. The quad bikes are under the command of Second Lieutenant Dennis Granche. Behind the quad bikes is a modified Land Cruiser and it has mounted on it a heavy anti-aircraft machine gun. Behind the modified Land Cruiser are modified GMC trucks with Browning heavy machine guns mounted on them. All of the trucks are reinforced with armored plating. Behind the modified GMC trucks are modified Land Cruiser trucks with PKMS heavy machine guns in tow. The next display is by the 15 Amod Brigade with personnel and vehicles drawn from the 153 Amod Regiment. The first troop is made up of the Cobra Electro Optic Surveillance Systems Amod personnel carriers. They are equipped with gunshot detection systems designed to detect, locate, and provide feedback on hostile fire. 
They are also used to conduct monitoring and surveillance in order to gather accurate and timely information. They are under the command of Captain Atu Kwamina Emisa. The vehicles have adopted the diamond formation. Behind them is the second troop made up of Cobra 2 armored personnel carriers. They are used to support assault troops in conducting special operations such as raids. They have adopted the wedge formation and are under the command of Lieutenant Enoch Tichi Amofa. Following the troop closely are the Haki armored personnel carriers. They are under the command of Second Lieutenant Abna Dufie Echampong. Distinguished invited guests, it may interest you to know that the Huskies are being operated by an all female crew. The Huskies are versatile military vehicles primarily used for route clearing and mine detection operations. The vehicles have adopted the box formation. The next troop is made up of BR-6 armored personnel carriers. They are commanded by 2nd Lieutenant Prosper Sefa Kwekuga with warrants of Star Class 1 Apu James as the troop warrant officer. They are in the V formation. The V formation is used when the enemy situation is uncertain and the troop leader requires firepower to the front and the flanks. The last troop from the 15 Armored Brigade is made up of the Rattle Armored Fighting Vehicles, which are commanded by 2nd Lieutenant Bright Ifa. The Squadron Sergeant Major is Warrant Officer Class 1 Ata Seidu. Following the personnel and equipment from 15 Armored Brigade are the personnel and equipment from the 66th Artillery Regiment, which is located at the Volta Barracks in Hull in the Volta region. The first to march past are the Yanan 122mm multiple rocket launcher systems, which have adopted the single file formation. They are under the command of the battery commander, Captain Jun Samwakun. The Battery Sergeant Major is Warrant Officer Class 1 Abuga Ibrahim. The next is the 122mm multiple rocket launcher systems which have adopted the diamond formation. They are under the command of Lieutenant Stefan Akanfe Atwima. The troop warrant officer is warrant officer class one, Marty George. 